in project management there are 10 knowledge areas that are used to manage projects from start to finish these 10 knowledge areas are integration scope time cost quality human resources communication risk procurement and stakeholder management in this video we will explain each knowledge area and provide examples of how they are used in project management the first knowledge area is integration this knowledge area involves coordinating all the other knowledge areas and processes to ensure that the project is completed successfully an example of the integration knowledge area is when a project manager is working on a construction project the project manager would use the integration knowledge area to ensure that all the other knowledge areas are integrated and working together to complete the project on time and within budget the second knowledge area is scope this knowledge area involves defining the project scope creating a detailed project scope statement and ensuring that the project stays within scope an example of scope knowledge area is when a project manager is working on a software development project the project manager would use the scope knowledge area to define the project scope create a project scope statement and ensure that the project stays within scope by managing scope creep the third knowledge area is time this knowledge area involves developing a project schedule estimating task duration and ensuring that the project is completed on time an example of the time knowledge area is when a project manager is working on a product launch project the project manager would use the time knowledge area to develop a project schedule estimate task duration and ensure that the project is completed on time by managing project timelines the fourth knowledge area is cost this knowledge area involves developing a project budget estimating cost and ensuring that the project is completed within budget an example of the cost knowledge area is when a project manager is working on a marketing campaign the project manager would use the cost knowledge area to develop a project budget estimate cost and ensure that the project is completed within budget by managing project finances the fifth knowledge area is quality this knowledge area involves defining project quality requirements creating a quality management plan and ensuring that the project meets the required quality standards an example of the quality knowledge area is when a project manager is working on a manufacturing project the project manager would use the quality knowledge area to define quality requirements create a quality management plan and ensure that the project meets the required quality standards by managing quality metrics the sixth knowledge area is risk management this knowledge area involves identifying analyzing and managing potential risk that may affect the project success risk management also involves developing contingency plans and mitigating risks to ensure that the project is completed as planned an example of the risk management knowledge area is when a project manager is working on a software development project the project manager would use the risk management knowledge area to identify and assess potential risks develop contingency plans and mitigate risks to ensure that the project is completed without any major issues the seventh knowledge area is procurement management this knowledge area involves identifying selecting and managing suppliers and vendors who will provide goods and services for the project procurement management also involves developing and managing contracts and ensuring that the project procurement process is carried out according to plan the eighth knowledge area is stakeholder management this knowledge area involves identifying and managing all stakeholders who are involved or have an interest in the project 
Stakeholder management also involves developing a communication plan to ensure that stakeholders are informed of the project progress. The ninth knowledge area is human resource management. This knowledge area involves managing the project team and ensuring that they have the necessary skills and resources to complete the project. Human resource management also involves team building, training and conflict resolution to ensure that the project team is cohesive and work well together. The tenth knowledge area is change management. This knowledge area involves managing changes to the project scope, schedule and budget. Change management also involves assessing the impact of changes, getting approval from stakeholders and implementing the changes in a controlled and systematic manner. And that's it for the 10 knowledge areas of project management. By understanding and applying these knowledge areas, Project managers can ensure that their projects are completed on time, within budget and to the satisfaction of all stakeholders.